So, you know, it's just like me. I, I come from Shady Acres. Shady Acres had a problem. I owe them everything. I owe them for my, all my family and all my children. And, and uh, I own for all my grandchildren that are saved. Amen. If Amen. it weren't for that church, uh, we wouldn't have Christ. Amen. And so uh, I appreciate them. And so we're there for them. Amen. When therefore I perform this and have a seal to them their fruit, I will come to you by Spain. So Paul says, I'm going to go visit uh, Spain. I'm going to come back and visit you. He still has a Roman church on his heart. And I am sure that when I come unto you, I shall come in the fullness of the blessings of the gospel of Christ. He says, I'm going to preach. Amen. Count on that. Amen. I'm going to preach and I'm going to bring some blessings. He says, I'm not going to be that hard preacher in 1 Corinthians, 2 Corinthians, where I blistered everybody and told them, you know, y'all need to get right. You know, it ain't right for you to be married to your mother. You know, I mean, you know, just not right. You know, and I mean, he blistered them hard, 1 Corinthians. St. Corinthians, I mean, Paul's, you know, I mean, he's looking under every rock. I mean, if you got any kind of sin, he's blistering you. And uh, he says, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to be a blessing. Amen. I'm going to be a blessing. I'm coming to be a blessing. And I'm coming so that you can uh, hear me preach. And nothing like hearing an old man. We heard about an old preacher uh, died in Pennsylvania. And uh, you either were for him or against him. There was no in-between. I mean, you either loved the man or you hated the man. And uh, that, that's just the way it was. And uh, I appreciate anybody that had just lived for God the whole life. Amen. Whether I agree with everything Amen. he says or not, it really doesn't make a difference. Amen. You know, I, I appreciate somebody that, 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 that's going to stick by the stuff and make it all the way through. Amen. I appreciate yeah. that. Amen. Now, I beseech you, brethren, for the Lord Jesus Christ's sake and for the love of the Spirit that you strive together with me and your prayers to God for me. So Amen. Paul's asking for prayer. And every pastor needs prayer. Amen. Pray from a pastor. I need him to, amen, get a hold of God. Amen. amen. I need him to have something uh, for the visitors. I need him to have amen. something amen. for me. I need him to, you know, get a hold of me. Right. And amen. so you ought to strive together. Amen. Uh, that I may be delivered from them that do not believe in Judea. And, and my services that I have for Jerusalem may be accepted of the saints. So he's asking for two specific prayers in verse 31, uh, that the Jews won't get upset with me. And number two, they're going to actually accept the offering. And they do. They wind up accepting the offering. I mean, when you ain't got nothing to eat, you'll take pretty much anything. Oh, yeah. You, know? oh, yeah. Yeah. you got canned okra, canned okra, huh? Oh, yeah, I love canned okra, you know? Yeah, <laughs> but when you're starving, you'll eat anything. Oh, yeah. I mean, in the Old yeah. Testament, they were eating dungs, uh, uh, yes. pigeon yes. dung. I mean, you know, they were just to survive. They were eating that, mm. and so that's kind of rough, you know, for yeah. me. But uh, that's what the old, the, the Old Testament says: that I may come unto you with joy by the will of God, and may be with you uh, refreshed. Paul says, not only do I want to refresh you, I want you to refresh me. Amen. Let's just have a good time in the Lord. Amen. And uh, I come with joy. Joy. I like it when preachers Amen. come with joy. They have a happy thought, you know. Amen. And they have a happy message. And, yeah. and they get you up to the mountain. Amen. And uh, I like to hang with them guys. Amen. Oh, yeah. I don't mind the ones right. that will rip off your head and spit down your neck. I, I mean, you know, right. I'll even put up with them. But I prefer a happy message. Amen. Yeah, and one right. with joy and peace. Yeah. and Amen. Everything's going to be all right. Just hang in there. I like those. I like the joy messages. Amen. Full of joy. Full of joy. Now the God of peace be with you all. Amen. So Paul concludes Amen. the last chapter, verse chapter 15. We'll finish the book next week, next Sunday. And uh, he says, hey, I want you, uh, the God of peace be with you. And uh, people don't talk like that. You know, when, when people, you know, have been to count, well, I'll see you later. You know, that's pretty much it. Paul's writing this letter and he's saying, listen, uh, I hope the God of peace be with you. And just stay with you. And uh, just dwell in you. And he was really getting down to the nitty gritty and saying, I really appreciate you and I want you to know God. 
I want you to look at that. That's the one thing. Just sitting here on, on Sunday morning, Thursday night, ain't enough. Just reading your Bible is not enough. Uh, just praying is not enough. You've got to ask God, Lord, I want that relationship between me and you. I want you to be able to talk to me. Amen. Amen. Be able to speak to me, whether it's the Word of God being preached, or whether it's me reading the Bible, whether it's uh, a billboard or whatever. I mean, just just thought. And God will speak to you through any kind yes, of way. Amen. Amen. Be just, you know, you'll be at work and you'll hear somebody say something, and all of a sudden, y'all say, That's me talking to you. Right. Amen. And He's just trying to communicate. And we get so busy, we don't listen. Amen. We don't listen. Amen. You don't hear. That's right. true. That's right. And so a lot of times, we, we're so busy with our lives that we don't have time for the God of peace to come in and move in and just tell us, hey, just hang in there. It's going to be all right. It's going to be all right. Amen. 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 Yes. be with you. Yeah. And God's going to help you. God's going to bless you. Right. Amen. Amen. Well, Father, we love you. I pray God. <laughs>